afternoon everyone my name is uh, sondar rajan and i head the sales for uh, cox and kings leisure and educational tours and thank you for inviting us uh, to showcase our services which we do in educational tours we would like to start with an av which will showcase our services uh, which will give you a background what we do and what we propose to do can we have the av please showcased is what we do with the uh, students uh, kind of schools we handle at cox and kings our brand for schools is called uh, udan cox and kings udan it our educational tour business was started in about 9 years before where predominantly from delhi we used to handle and later on it was branded under udan for the last 4 years 4 years before we branded uh, with a brand called udan with the brand called udan and uh, we started doing schools all over india now we have a uh, locations over 150 location across india and we have 10 branches who does educational tours now what do we do in educational tours uh, in per se it just not uh, taking the students to some some destination and you know making them uh, see the sightseeing spots that's not we what we do what we do is once the school proposes that okay these are my hundred students who want to go to a destination we meet their teachers we meet the principal and we customize the tour as per their needs 
outdoor learning, a including a destination, we make sure that the syllabus, whatever they have, is covered under this, uh, you know, tour. And uh, the number of days is covered based on the learning which they want to do. Now, there was a concept that outdoor learning, most of the peop uh, schools had a mindset five years before that, okay, taking somebody to a camping uh, near Delhi or anywhere near India is called, a, you know, learning, outdoor learning. That's not to be proposed. Camping is one of the aspects which we do, but along with that, we plan to teach a student a lot of things on when they are, uh, you know, uh, travel. Like what we do is, we, during the tour, we plan and design the itinerary to increase their personal development. Like we go to the level where an individual student is also targeted that, okay, teacher, uh, plans an itinerary and says, okay, these are my five students in the class where they uh, lack the self-confidence. Can we do something for them? So if a trainer is uh, conducting a tour, then he makes sure that, that those five students are identified and groomed on the self-confidence and these, uh, you know, personal, interpersonal skills and all. So we do activities uh, to increase that. During the course, because we will, if we focus on those students, like teachers also how, how they propose, if they focus on the students and make them as, okay, let's do it, uh, you lack the self-confidence, let's improve by doing activity, we don't do it. We do it in a very fun way, where even if it is a rock, cl rock climbing or snorkeling or, you know, rappling, in that we make them as a leader, just, I'm, giving, I'm just giving you an example, we make them as a leader and give them the confidence that yes, you can lead or, you know, uh, a leader team member of five people and you know do the activity accordingly so like that we do a lot of activities that's the highlights of our program and you know uh, the kind of activity we do now teachers when they conduct a tour they propose that okay these are the results and goals which we want out of the tour even if it is conducting a, a tour for four uh, days to Hyderabad I'm just giving an example four days to Hyderabad Itinerary is planned where, yes, we include the sightseeing sp spots, not to, you know, including Chaminar and everything, but half a day or, a, you know, two half days are planned so that they say, okay, these are the results and goals we, which we want to cover uh, during this tour. It can be an industrial visit also which can be included in the tour when it is conducted. And the real-time experience of the, you know, team worker is analyzed because we have a trainer who is along with the teachers because every 15 students we make sure that we send our representative plus a teacher from the school is uh, accompanying them for every 15 students. So what they do is during the course of the day, be it their obedience, be it their teamwork, uh, how they have conducted themselves, it's all analyzed and discussed during the dinner time. That's how you know we make them uh, learn when they are outside. Now, how, how the quality of uh, the checks are done on our tour? Like pre-tour, we have a detailed orientation program with the students that this is what it is proposed and these are the things which you need to carry and these are the things which you should not be doing, don'ts and do, all the activities, which I properly explain to the students. That kind of give a, give a base for the entire tour that is conducted 15 days before the tour to, with the students. So, along with the teachers who are traveling with the group, principal and us, we go and present that these are the uh, activity planned and these are the uh, things which we do, uh, which we're going to do. And accommodation part, we make sure that the accommodation is selected and uh, uh, booked in such a way that there is no trouble in the logistics. In terms of food, we purely ask even the students that what kind of food he would prefer and vegetarian or non-vegetarian or, you know, something different uh, which teachers would recommend us. Every day it has changed. A compulsory medical aid is carried with our two managers, which is, and doctor on call is given uh, for every tour. And safety is very important. We recently have started, I mean, you know, six months before when we conducted this two, uh, tour for one school, we had proposed that school that why don't we send a, a personalized uh, security guard with the, you know, students when they travel. It was idea taken from the school and we had sent uh, because uh, it was uh, all girls traveling, uh, you know, to uh, Bangalore, having done Bangalore Mysore tea. So we had proposed and it was done accordingly that every, there were four security personal guards were sent on that tour. And we plan in such a way that on tour, there are no deviations are done 
uh, on tour and the student should not deviate from the you know usual itinerary so everything we try to cover because the parents are also called uh, you know for this briefing when they ask question we have a q and a for an hour uh, with the you know parents and all where they come and ask you okay this is what you propose to do these are my questions or these are my faqs so we conduct that now once these catalogs are given to the school with the proposed destinations wherein we you know kind of jotted down zone wise that north zone you have a scope of doing these destination which will come under educational you know travel like an ancient temple and because nowadays the trend is changing that practical experience after going there and seeing uh, will get a lot of uh, you know uh, learnings to the students so we kind of make sure that even if it is a himalayan range like recently we conducted a trip to shillong because for northeast if i say northeast including the teachers will summarize okay gangtok darjeeling and kalimpong would be a northeast they don't know about shillong or they don't know about the Chira, you know cherapunji as a destination so we try to cover that and give uh, kind of you know learnings from that also so we kind of select the destinations with the scope of educational travel not commercializing uh, it only to the travel zone wise because we have a pan india presence so it is done it is done zone wise with north zone west zone predominantly lot of schools travel in and around uh, from delhi because uh, the driving distance and the options are uh, you know many so we have uh, more options in north now many people ask that okay everything the destination is yesterday also there was a lady who asked that why should we travel you with you you know if the destination are going to be same and if the hotel is going to be the same why should we travel with you not with you know uh, with anyone else so we say that we were if not the first one but we are the ones who create a innovative and you know creative uh, programs for the students we were the one who uh, created a parallel brand uh, for the college and institutes uh, like an example that if a college third year students want to experience then we take them to bangalore have a induction program done in wipro to expose them to the corporate world and he sees it because next year he is going to jump into the corporate world so we kind of do that uh, tours as well on cities like bangalore hyderabad and all so we have this innovative uh, ideas customized as per the school we don't copy paste and you know uh, uh, kind of do everything and uh, to the colleges same thing so we customize so our two be two managers or be it our staff across uh, india they first go to the school meet them commercially yes we have the you know benefit of uh, consolidating and giving good rates but apart from that there are ideas which uh, was which is sold not the destination we understand that okay these are the 100 students or 10th class we 10th class or 11th class or 12th class we understand what do you need from this tour and then accordingly it comes to our corporate office it is customized and it is given back that okay this is what you can propose it just not the travel logistics and accommodation and we have two managers who are experienced uh, on ground the trainers which we use are uh, uh, over you know they have been doing training for the last 15 uh, years so so uh, that's what uh, we conduct and it's time out the lady says so uh, thank you so much for the gi giving time and uh, uh, please feel free to contact our offices these are just a random our you know photographs which you wanted to show uh yeah so thank you so much thank you